Welcome to your cardio and core challenge class today. What we're going to do is do eight blocks of exercises, each four minutes long, followed by a minute of rest. In each block, you're going to have three cardio exercises or three core exercises. They're going to vary in length from 10 seconds to 20 seconds to 30 seconds long. We're going to repeat through three times, and then the last bit of the exercises are each going to be 20 seconds long. The rest for them also vary from 10 seconds to 20 seconds to 30 seconds to the minute between the blocks of the exercises. So we're going to get warm up going on grab a sip of water at any point in time pause me at any point in time as well and fast forward if you don't like the block that i'm doing or feel free to change up the moves this is your workout so you're going to do as many reps as you can in the given amount of time first of all we're just going to start with our warm-up as we do that i want to squat down and do shoulder retraction so i'm squeezing my shoulder blades together chest remains lifted and if you were to look down at your knees, they should be in line with your feet, but not going over your toes. Let's go for four. Getting as low as you feel comfortable. Okay, get a little bit wider. We're going to cross our hands, go thumbs back, and again, focus on squeezing your shoulder blades together.
My thumbs are turning back. Try to open up the shoulder joint. Two to go. Hold your one leg back here and pulse and squeeze the shoulders. Last eight. Four, step it in together. Squat, narrow, pulse. I'm lifting my toes, squeezing the shoulder blades. I have eight. We're gonna repeat the lunge and pulse on the other leg. Pull back, now my arms, they're straighter. Here. All right. Can you go for eight? Last four. Legs together, mini pulse here. Pulling your abs. Last eight, then I'm gonna walk my hands forward till I get into a forward plank. Here we go. Inch them down. Bring it back. And bring your hands back. Again, three more times. Remember, this is it. Cardio and core challenge. There'll be lots of moves where you're on your hands, working your shoulders, and your core. Last one. Take one foot forward into a front lunge, and then take your hands to the side. I want you to drop your knee toward the ground, push into your heel. Down and push. Now lift your inside arm. Look up. Just knee going down and up. All right, you're gonna thread your arm through and lift. Three more times. That's two. We're gonna repeat on the other side. Step back, switch legs, knee going down. Push into your heel. You ready to add your arm? Lift up. Lift up and thread for four. Exhale as you push through. Go back to the plank. As you do a plank in your workout, make sure that you're trying to look forward, drop your shoulder blades back, squeeze your glutes, walk your hands back in, and round your shoulders up and back. Grab a sip of water. Here comes your first cardio block. Four minutes of work, followed by a minute of rest. Your first cardio block has three moves, mountain climbers, break dancers, and a form of a burpee. Again, variants of 30 seconds, 20 seconds, and 10 seconds long. When you do a break dancer, you're going from a mountain climber, which from the side looks like this, and the break dancer is where you're going to take your leg, kick it, and lift your arm up. And then pivot, plant your heel, lift, so you're basically pointing your toe. If you don't want to do a mountain climber, do a high knee run. If you don't want to do a break dancer, do alternating kicks. And the last move being a burpee, we're gonna just stay down low in our burpee. So if you don't want that, just do squats. These are our moves. 30 seconds of mountain climber, 20 seconds of break dance, 10 seconds of a burpee, followed by 10 seconds of rest, Repeat, but change the amount of time we're doing for each of them. So here we go. Get down into your mountain climber or your high knee run. It's your choice. 30 seconds begins now. I want my shoulders over my hands. Fast as you can go. Light on your feet. 10 seconds till you go into the break dancers. Here we go. Pivot. Your back knee stays. 
knees bent. Five. Then you're gonna do 10 seconds of the burpee. Here we go. Stay low though. Basically a plank squat. Rest for 10. Now we're gonna do 10 seconds of mountain climbers. Ready, set, go. Seconds break dancers. Last ten, then you have twenty burpee. Hands up to shoulders. Go for five. And rest for 20 seconds. This time we're going to be doing 10 seconds of mountain climbing. Starting in 10. I take that back. I need 20 seconds of mountain climbers. Three, two, one. Ten more. Then you'll need 10 seconds of break dance. Ready, set, go. Followed by 30. Burpee, here it is, 30. Then you have a 30 second rest. Rest for a minute. Deep breath. <sighs> Mountain break dance burpee. In ten. Hands under shoulders. In five, get into your plank. Ready? Set. Twenty on. Can you go faster? Five to break dance. Hit it. Twenty. Your heel acts as your break. Then point your toe. Five to burpee. Here we go. Stay low. Hop. Almost done. Here's 10. Last one. You're done. One minute rest. And then we'll go on to our core. Have a sip of water. Three core moves, push-ups, flutter kicks, and then Superman. Push-ups, hands under your shoulder, elbows coming back on your knees or your toes. If you don't wanna do push-ups, you can do shoulder protraction and retraction. Number two, flutter kick. Your arms are gonna alternate like this and your legs are gonna alternate like so. 
Arms are not gonna touch down. When you go to Superman, arms are either gonna be bent or straight, your choice. Lift them both up at the same time, as well as your legs. Hold as long as you want. There are your moves, push-ups, flutter kicks, Superman. Let's begin, 30 seconds of push-ups. Three, two, one. Push your heels together. Try to look forward slightly. If you want to go a little faster and it's a little bit less pressure on your shoulders, come on your knees. You've got five till you flutter kick. Drop down, alternate for 20 seconds. Abs are pulling in. Squeeze your glutes the whole time. In 10, you have 10 of Superman with both arms and legs coming up. Here we go, up and down. Relax if you want. You only have 10 seconds. Five until you rest for 10. And rest. We're now going into push-ups. A little bit uh, quicker if you want. There's only 10 seconds of them. In three, two, and one. Oh, I lied, there's 20 seconds of them. What the heck? Getting the hard stuff over with. 10 more. Last three, then you're gonna flutter. Come down, 30 seconds. Point those toes, nice and straight legs. Ten seconds till you have your Superman. And lift, ten. Up and down if you want, followed by a rest. 20 seconds rest. Back to your push-ups. Deep breath, shoulders relaxing. Try to push your heels together. In 10 we go. Push into your heels. Here's three, two, and one. 10 seconds. Drop down, flutter for 20. In 10, you have Superman for 30. Here we go, lift up and recover if you want. You don't have to ever let it touch if you wanna make it harder. Exhale, lift. Ten, and then you have a rest for thirty. Come into child's pose with me. We have one more block, twenty seconds each, followed by your minute of rest before we do the cardio. push-ups can you do in 20 seconds or shoulder protraction and retraction you're gonna find out if you count you've got five find your position in your plank let's go squeeze your glutes halfway Drop down, give me a flutter. Ten till you Superman. Three, two, 
both arms and legs, squeeze the shoulder blades, squeeze your glutes, relax when you're ready. Push those shoulders away from your ears. Three, two, child's pose, you have a minute rest. Take one hand under the other arm, turn, press your shoulder down. Repeat on the other side, taking in deep breaths. Grab yourself a sip of water, 30 seconds to go. Three new moves. We're doing squat hops. We're gonna do jumping jacks and skaters. Again, same pattern as we did before with how much time we do each exercise for. Squat hops in 10 seconds, then your jacks, then your skaters. The first exercise is gonna be for 30 seconds. You're ready, set, go. Push back, lift. If you don't wanna lift up, go on your toes. Try to see yourself as having straight back with your chest lifted. Soft landing. Go for 10. Last three, then we jacked. Here we go. Soft feet for 20. In 10, we have skaters for 10. That's five. Ready, set, go. Fast as you can. Three, two, one, rest 10. Here we go again. Squat hops, 10 seconds. Three, Two, one, push. Jacks, 30. Low impact option. Then your skaters. Twenty. Three, two, one. Then you're hopping over something. Go as wide as you can and explode up. Ten more. Let me rest. Three, two, twenty second rest. Here comes your squat hops. 20 seconds. In 10. How low do you want to go? Three. Drop it. Two. One. 10. I'm thinking it should be 20, yes? Keep going. Two jacks for ten. Go. Three, two, skaters, thirty. Rest 30, 20, 20, 20, rest a 
minute. And core. Feet are moving. Breathing deep. Squat hops. In 10. There's five, three, how many? Wanna count them? Let's go. Two. Can you beat me? two pulses, bridge, lay on your back, feet hip width apart, lift your hips as high as you can, up and down, or just hold them. 10 seconds till we do a reverse plank. Arms extend out, push into your tricep, push into your heel, squeeze your glutes. Can you stay up for 30 seconds? Breathing deeply, push your shoulders away from your ears. You're gonna feel this in your hamstrings. If you need to take a little pressure off your shoulders, lift your head up. Can you lift a little bit higher? Go for five, then I'm gonna do scissor legs. Alternate your leg in the air. It's 20 seconds. Watch my bottom leg, I pulse for two, and I'm pointing the toes. Abs are coming in. Then I'm gonna bridge, it's only for 10 seconds. So I want your butt close to your heels and push with the balls of your feet. Here we go. Push and lift, hips as high as you can. Then we rest for 10. Three, two, and rest. Going back to the reverse plank. This time, you're going only for 10 seconds. Triceps down. Push in your heels, lift. Breathe. Three, here comes your scissors. Let's go for 30. Shoulders are away from your ears. If you need to take a break, feel free to lay down. You're halfway. Then you're gonna bridge for 20. To be able to activate those glutes, I really need you to push with the middle of your foot down, not your heels. Here we go. If you push more heels, then you're gonna get more hamstring, but I want your glutes firing. Hips as high as they can go, push your triceps down. 10. Two more rounds are coming, getting into your reverse plank. Here it is. 20 seconds, triceps, oh, <laughs> rest first, what? Why would we wanna rest? Do we really want that? I was getting all keen for that plank, okay. <laughs> you ready? Tummy 
tight. 20, 20 seconds for real. Lift up. Gonna lift those hips as high as I can. Followed by a scissor. It's only gonna be for 10 seconds. Five, two, and one. Here we go. Five until you bridge. If you hip width, lift, triceps down. If you want to add arms, what I actually do is work on a little bit of posture, reach over and pull in. Again, press with the ball of those feet, balls of feet. How do you say that? <laughs> I'll go for 10. Three, two, it's a 30 second rest, followed by 20, 20, 20. Reverse plank, if you wanted to make it easier, you could actually put your upper back on something elevated. You ready? Let's go. Actually, no, I keep cheaping you out on your recovery. I get really excited about the reverse plank. It's my new favorite move, by the way. Okay, arms out. Triceps down, abs in, push, 20. Just your breathing. Can you go a little higher? Three, two, scissor. You're pulling on the top leg just slightly, a little bit of a hamstring stretch. Five, till you bridge. Here we go. Wanna do the arms? Last three, two, and rest. All right, here comes your cardio. Grab a sip of water and we're gonna move on. For your cardio block, one, two, three, knee. If you don't like that, do high knee. We're gonna do split lunges. If you don't like that, this option, or cross country. And then finally, mogos. And if you're not okay with the hop, feel free to go up on your toe, and you're just gonna go side to side. Get yourself set, get your sip of water, and away we go. All right, starting with one, two, three, knee. You want to start to travel side to side, or again, you could do high knee. Five seconds, get ready, set, here we go for 30. Drive the knee to your chest, sprint your arms. Come on, you're halfway. Split lunges for 20 seconds. How low can you get your knee? Moles in five. Here we go. Knees together. Punch your pulse. Five to go. Rest. All right. Back to the top. One, two, three. Knee. In three, two, one. Hit it for ten. Oops. 
split lunges, 30. Or, or, chest is up, 15. Five the moguls. Hit at 20. Quiet feet. Not here. 10. Three. Rest for 20. Two more sets. One, two, three, knee for 20 seconds. In 10. Five. Ready, set, hit it. 20. Six counts. Five to your split lunge for 10. Let's go. Three to Lolos. Hit it for 30. Knees, obliques, abs in.
So again, if that's hard on your shoulders, drop down, high plank to your knees, go from there. Five to a breast stroke. Come on down, draw your upside down heart with your hands. Keep going, if you need to see me again, bring those elbows back, lengthen. Five, till you beast. Hands and knees, lift your knees up. Option, lift your arm, turn your thumb up. Tailbone lifts, rest. So again, that beast is hands under shoulders, you just lift your knees up. Move your arms if you want. Let's go again. Tricep push-ups. Here we go. 10 seconds. Drop down. 30 seconds. Breast stroke. Inhale. Exhale. Glutes tight, squeeze your elbows back, 10, five to beast, for 20, here we go, hands, knees up, tailbone up, lift if you like, try not to let your hips move. Five. To rest for 20. You want a child's pose, you could. In 10, you have 20 seconds of tricep push-up, or you could do those dips, fingers towards your feet. In five, three, two, here we go. shoulder stabilization. If you don't like this, you want to drop to your knees. You need a break. Five, three, two, 30 seconds. They went 20, 20, 20. Come up, tuck everything. seconds. Get into your tricep position. So you're in a plank. Hands under shoulders. Pushing the heels. 20 on.
Bend your shoulders up, 30 seconds. Grab your water, and we'll talk about what's next. For your cardio, diagonal lunge plus hop. So I'm gonna diag, for your cardio, diagonal lunge plus hop. So I'm gonna diagonal lunge, hop, bring it together. See, if I can do this, stay in the frame. It's not really important how fast you go, it's how well you do this. You can change your arms in any format that you'd like. Second, we're gonna do heel clip jacks. If that's not okay, you can go back to your regular jack with the toe tap to the side or squat side. And finally, squat hops, squat 180s. We're going to try to touch down with a straight back. We're going to come up. If that's not for you, again, this would be a better option. Trying to touch down with your legs, lowering you not because your butt is up and you're leaning forward. Here are your moves, diagonal lunge, then we have heel click jacks and squat 180. Diagonal lunge is gonna be for uh, 30 seconds. So you're gonna step out, hop, step together. Here we go. How low can you drop your back knee? Five. 
rest. One more. One in 20, 20. Notice these all have plyometrics in them. Thus, they are more tiring. In 10, diagonal, let's start this direction. Three, two, twenty on. Come on, hang in there with me. Couple more. Five, three, jacks, yes. Here's your squat. With this one, you're done your cardio. Ten. side planks. I want to do X ups. You lift your option arm and your leg while laying on your back, followed by Spider-Man. So grab the water and then we will begin by laying on our side to do a side plank. First exercise is a side plank. Come on your elbow underneath your shoulder. You're gonna be able to lift up, go on your knees, turn to the other side. Or you could do it on your toes. In three, two, for 30 seconds. Don't let your hips go up and down. You're not in a hurry, okay? Take your time. Slower is going to be harder. You push into your heels. Two more, and then I want you to lay on your back, arms and legs wide. X up, opposite arm and leg lift. If you need a little help, put your hand down. You could also bend your elbow and your knee. Five to go. Flip over on your high plank. Step out, step together. There's only 10 seconds of the Spider-Man. And rest. We're starting again. Side plank, alternating. This time, there's only 10 seconds. This one, we will go faster on. Here we go. Three. Two, lay on your back. X up. 25 more. Can you hear yourself? Exhale as you lift. Yes, please. Point the toe. Ten. Then you need to flip over. Go to your Spider Man. Here we go. Go for 20. Look forward. Hands under shoulders. Five. And rest. Going to the side plank again in 15 seconds. All right, this time through, you're going for 20. Elbow under shoulder, inside knee down, 
or those legs straight, your choice. Ready, go. around I will add in a stretch but if you're done make sure you stretch especially through your hip flexors and your shoulders grab some water and uh, thank you so much for joining me again stick around if you want to for the stretch all right join me in just taking a deep breath in and out one more Take your hands together, rotate your wrists. And go the other way. Okay. Take one hand behind you, pull down on your forearm. So it pulls your shoulder blades together. Take the same leg, step back. Bend the knee, tuck your hips under. Now, tilt your head to the side. Just breathe. Did a lot of work in the hip flexors. Do you want to elongate them? Because they're crying. What have you done to me? Turn your chin down. Tilt the head. 
Try closing your eyes. It's a balance challenge. Chin to shoulder. Knees together, shoulders back, hips under. When I say the word quad, what do you think of? Quadricep muscles. So how many muscles are in a quad? How many wheels are on a quad? Let your head relax. Walk your hands toward the outside of one of your feet. Don't let your hip move. Keep a push back. Feeling it extra in the hamstring on the side that you are reaching to, as well as a little bit in your lower back on the other side. Walk it to the other side. Also feeling it in the calf. Keep those hips back. Everything up like a cat. Let yourself come into child's pose. Lengthen through the fingertips. Drop your head. Round yourself up again. Come to one side. You're on your elbow under your shoulder. Take hold of your ankle. Place your knee down and relax. Lift. You're tucking your hips under. Take a deep breath. On your exhale, pivot till your forearm touches the outside of your other arm. Keep your abs engaged. Extend the leg that was behind you, toe to ceiling. Hinge yourself forward for hamstring. Reach across with your opposite hand. Press against your leg and look at your other hand behind you. you're now going to turn and press your knee and look away. It is now this bent leg that we're going to stretch for our hamstrings. So we repeat. Take this leg out. I always put my other foot down low toward the ankle so my hips are squared. We're hinging, reaching, pressing, and looking away. I'm going to try to keep our toe pointed to the ceiling.
take another deep breath. Exhale, release, grab hold over the knee, bend, scoot your butt if you need to. Here's your push and look. Press your back, straighten it up. So this leg was the hamstring stretch that comes around. I glue my heel to my butt, put my knee down, release, take a deep breath in, exhale, pivot, arm to floor, abs to back. Another breath in, exhale, push yourself up. We're going into crisscross comfortable position. I want to go into tricep stretch. Deep breath, relax your back, relax your shoulders. and switch to the other tricep. So now we're sitting tall, pushing the elbow back. One more time, breathe. Exhale, shoulder, thumb down. Either head up or let it come down. behind you. Lock your thumbs together and then bring them over to one side. Pull the shoulders back. Chin to shoulder. Chin to ceiling. Fabulous day, and I'm really thankful for the time that you spent with me. Take care.